Hi, I'm Donald with Steambright Supply, and today we're going to talk about the TM33-340 trailer mount restoration system. Now, we originally got this uh, pressure washer from Hydrotech, and then we customized it so that it can be used in more industries. Uh, this is a uh, 33 horsepower combined system. We have an 18 horsepower engine used on the pressure washer side, and then we have a 15 horsepower system used on the vacuum side. Uh, the first thing that we did when these show up is we actually extended the pressure washer 10 inches more to the front to allow for the vacuum hose reel to be placed between the two of them. And this is sent to you as a kit. It's real easy to bolt on. They're already notched. You just drill them and bolt them in or we can do it for you. On the uh, pressure washer itself, we added a secondary unloader system. The factory loader on this particular unit is set at 4,000 PSI, at five gallons a minute. And that's when this ball valve is closed off. This one takes over. If you're gonna be cleaning in low pressures like uh, carpet cleaning, upholster cleaning, or tile and grout cleaning at 400, 500, or 1,500 PSI, you simply just open up this uh, ball valve and then adjust the pressure on the second unloader. We also switched out the uh, pressure switch. Uh, this is now set at 215 PSI and added a pressure gauge. Um, this is a safety device here that if in the event you develop a hose rupture, the kerosene burner actually will not operate. This is set to the burner side. Sometimes these are also set to the low oil shutdown on the engine, but in this particular model it's actually designed to turn the uh, um, burner off in the event you have a broken hose. So coming down around this way, it's kind of tight in here, but you can get a better view of this is a powder coated uh, reel, holds 200 feet of vacuum hose. We preloaded it with 165 feet. <coughs> uh, we also put a hose reel with uh, the Steam Bright Pro 4000 hose on it. It has 160 feet of hose with a ball valve and a non-marking female quick disconnect. Now this particular reel does have a pin lock system on it so that you can actually lock it in place and it can't accidentally spool when you're driving down the road. Over here, we uh, preloaded this stainless steel reel with 150 feet of double wire, 6,000 PSI pressure washing hose, as well as secured the gun and the lance to the generator. Now on the back side here, and Stephen, if you want to come back around the corner here, we'll show them what we've done here. We've actually extended the frame <coughs> of the um, trailer. So it's actually coming out four inches more on the rear. And we also turn the reels to be on the outbound side. This is the BE 4000, I'm sorry, BE 9000. It has a 1500 uh, horsepower engine on it. And this unit here is the Goliath Quad 6.6 .6 vacuum system. It is a 50 amp vacuum system with a 30 gallon a minute discharge system. It has an automatic defomer. And over on this other side, if you can come back around here. The uh, discharge can actually be done two ways. You can actually discharge through a garden hose connection. Or if you're doing water extraction work and you actually need to use lay flat hose, you can discharge through one and a half inch lay flat. Over here, uh, we're actually going to put two locks on this to hold the wand at this position. And uh, this way you can use this for your carpet cleaning. And this has a little bit of real estate over here left that you can put a milk crate if you want for some chemicals. But overall, you'll be able to do absolutely everything you want with this unit, from pressure washing all the way down to upholstery cleaning or water extraction work, air duct cleaning, and it's totally self-contained. You carry 200 gallons of fresh water with you, and uh, it's very reasonably priced. We have it available two options, one where we just ship it to you complete, and the others that we send it to you as a kit, and you do the little bit of upgrades that you've seen here. Anyway, thanks for watching.